Humberley History at a Glance. In 1965, God called a retired minister, Reverend Ralph Koshiewicz, and his wife from Michigan to come to Toronto to start a Church of God. When they arrived, they met with some members of the Elihi family from Trinidad who also wanted to see a Church of God in Toronto. The group under the leadership of Reverend and Mrs. Koshiewicz started the mission work, meeting in a German church owned by Reverend E. Bocher. By way of a gospel tract, they made contact with Reverend Irving G. Wins, who was pastoring a group of believers in the Rexdale area. This was a growing church with many children and young families. Robert and Lois McAfee, laypersons attending Brother Wynn's church, were sent to help the mission in the work of the Sunday school. In January of 1966, the two groups united to form the First Church of God in Toronto, with Reverend Wynn's as the pastor and Reverend Bocher as co-pastor. Of the 31 charter members, seven are still active in the church. They are as follows, Mr. and Mrs. Stephen Gokul, Mrs. Deborah Romano, Mrs. Zita Henson, Mrs. Grace Morgan, and Mr. and Mrs. Robert McAfee. A church building was purchased at 2810 Weston Road, and the Humberley Church of God was dedicated on April the 24th, 1966. Reverend Wins and Reverend Bocher moved out again into evangelistic work after six years. At that time, in 1972, Reverend and Mrs. John S. Bridal came to pastor the growing church until he was asked to become the overseer of Western Canada. In October of 1976, Reverend Ralph Glogo and Mrs. Shirley Glogo moved their family from Regina, Saskatchewan to Pastor Humber Lee Church of God in Toronto. In 1977, a Spanish congregation under the leadership of Pablo Maquita were searching for a place to worship. The Lord led them to contact us. They joined the Church of God and continued to worship with us. In October of 1979, Humberley Church experienced a fire and for the following year met in a nearby school gymnasium. During that year, we were reminded that in difficult times, God is able. In 1983, we were able to purchase the house next to the church, which we used as offices and classrooms. During this time, the congregation was growing steadily. By the fall of 1984, we started two morning services. When it became apparent that we could no longer expand at 2810, following a series of miracles, we purchased 4.5 acres of land on Islington Avenue in 1987, which included a parsonage for our pastor and family. In 1990, the Lord opened the door again for us to move to larger facilities and on our 24th anniversary weekend, we had our first services in these present facilities at 6807 Steeles Avenue West in Etobicoke. The same spring, the offices were moved from 2818 Weston Road to 7386 Islington Avenue to a mobile trailer unit. In 1999, Pastor Glogo was named moderator for the Church of God in Canada. To help him during that time, Reverend and Mrs. David Kwan served as assistant pastor from 1999 to 2002. Buildings at 68, 19, and 21 Steeles Avenue West were leased for use as shared office space, classrooms, and other ministry purposes, including the National Office, Mission Toronto, a gym, counseling services, and the Mukti Mission television program. These units were eventually let go and we leased 6809. 
Plans to build a church on the Islington Avenue site were met with much difficulty and many roadblocks. It was decided to sell that property and focus on this present site on Steeles Avenue West, where we took ownership of 6807 and 6809 in February of 2005. Extensive renovations were needed for 6809, which we refer to as the Ministry Center. Presently, it is used for classrooms, a gym, counseling services, IMTC, and various other ministry opportunities. The Glagos faithfully led Humberley through times of growth, development, and expansion with a strong focus on prayer, evangelism, and stewardship. Mrs. Shirley Glogo, after a courageous battle with cancer, went home to be with the Lord in February of 2001. She is affectionately remembered for her personal warmth, her commitment to Christ, her family, and the church. Her endless creativity, efficient administrative skills, and much more. In October of 2005, Pastor Ralph and Rita Gazee were married and continued to serve as Humberley's pastor. In January of 2012, Reverend Kevin and Mrs. Kathy Glogo joined the pastoral team together with their daughters, Kaylee and Emma. Pastor Kevin is now the lead pastor at Humberley. Time and space do not allow us to tell all the ways God has led his people, the people of Humberley, from our early days to the present. Our desire is to remain faithful to his calling and continue forward for his honor and glory.